All right, guys. Me and James are doing a little bit of a different thing today. We're up here working in Merritt. And, uh, we're, yeah, we're here working in Merritt, guys. We will be making this video from the truck today. Look at those broken trees. Do you see them? In the background? Yeah, right there. Oh, yeah. See that? There's one there, and then the next one beside it's broken, too. Interesting. There's too much snow in the areas we want to hike. It's freaking freezing up and, here. And, uh... We're going to be making it from the truck four, today. Four degrees. Yeah, we out, we got out of the truck and got back. I know. I seen that on the way in. For sure they could. You're up in the northern part of British Columbia or the interior part we're we're really south southern BC where we stay so the pro the lakes are still frozen up here Dude, I took some pictures on the ride up, out of the side of the vehicle, and uh, I think I might have caught something in there. I'm gonna have to go through the pics later. So yeah, we're just uh, going for a little cruzito here. Fucking squash douche, you know? I'm walking here! That's strictly for uh, Lib. Mr. Master Lib there. <laughs> Look at that tree, eh? We are at Marcord Lake. Freaking beautiful area up here, guys. So freaking nice. Dude, I love this fucking tree, man. It's trippy, eh? It's almost like it was placed there. <laughs> like, it's so weird, eh? The bark on it looks trippy as shit. Look at the bark, guys. It's like a little vest on that old bug. What is that? Is it something? Probably something about the lakes. Grasslands, a pool, a wide variety of plants and animals. There's a pallet up top there. It's for a nest. Cool. 
They put a nest the up there. Damage fences, gates, or other range improvements refrain from allowing non tenured animals to graze. <laughs> cool. He was just reading this sign here. Yeah, no, they do that in Alberta. And, uh, and like Fox Creek and stuff has them. And it's for like a certain type of bird. In Alberta, it's for a certain type of bird. And what happens is these birds nest on the uh, power lines. So they end up fucking having to move the nest. And they do it by putting pallets up so the birds have an easier access. Hmm. I wonder if you're able to fish. Another little there. frozen lake there. <laughs> oh, Jamie's like, oh shit! Nope, they out learning how to drive. Yeah, guys, this is beautiful high desert up here, man. High desert. We ain't playing up here, man. We actually work, and we aren't playing up here. You know, we do work. We do have jobs. One day, squatching will be our job, though. Among other things. Things that aren't going to hurt our bodies anymore. <laughs> Fuck. My back hurts. My elbows hurt. For everything freaking hurts these days, guys. And guess what? The god dang hot tub's out of commission at the Marauder Inn. <laughs> that goddamn scam Mata. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, I hope you guys don't mind this video. It's uh, going to be a little different than the regular, that's for sure. But, hey, it's maybe get to see us uh, in a little bit of a different way here. You know? Squatching straight from the truck, yo. That's how I do it. I got that zzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzz
like making snapshots. Clay, look at these hills, man. Chad, everybody out there, TikTok, YouTube world. Look at the beauty of this thing that we live on. It's fucking amazing, isn't it? Freaking amazing, guys. Take it in, baby. Take it in. What's going on here today? Gary? There it is, people. Entering Marat again. A little different today, guys. A little different. I just love that. y'all i'm gonna end this. this is just a short little video showing y'all merit here I'm trying to show you some of the areas here i hope y'all enjoyed this little view of another view of british columbia squatch out